ስላንትና ጤና ይስጥልን እኔ ራስ የዲኖስ ተፋሪ ነኝ አም ራስ አይዶንስ ተፋር ዘ ላንጅ ሶሳይቲ and the brotherhood of his imperial majesty kadamawi halaslase we like to announce some recently and newly published books a couple of years ago perhaps almost more than 10 years ago this book must be you can tell this book is kind of old right here this is the queen of sheba and only son minulik at least one of the copies that i've had and i've studied from over the years now this particular copy as you can see it's been worn out well worn well studied and the wallace budge version is one of the better versions of the translation of the cover and I guess I know there's some other versions out there and for students who are studying various versions and manuscripts and such very good but for us in the discipleship and the Rastafari disciples we were looking for what is most accurate and the Wallace Budge version of it is quite accurate and within this particular copy that was um published i think by uh the african publication society of london in um 1963 it was reprinted i think roughly around at that time by a gk dr gk ose we give thanks and praise for his reprinting of the queen of sheba and only son minulik the wallace budge translation otherwise we might not have had access ourselves and many others to this very important ethiopic work now what we'd like to announce is that we have been able to reprint and republish the queen of sheba and only son minulik and it's now available go to www.lojsociety.org click on the books tab and the books link and you'll see some of the newly and recently published um books and other study material and documents for bible studies for um personal home studies home schooling um for various different um departments of education majors and minors things that ones and ones such as ourselves are interested in and some of the essential books and documents like this one right here so this is now available the queen of sheba and her only son minulik for brief forward by yours truly and this is one of the recently and now available publications from the line of judas society soon we hope to have the good is the good is to this particular text up and available as well but based on our studies of the various different versions of the Queen of Sheba and only son Minulik this particular version by Wallace Budge is one that we highly highly recommend and each household at least should have a copy of this particular important Ethiopic work that explains as they say right here being the history of the departure of God and his ark of the covenant from Jerusalem to Ethiopia and the establishment of the religion of the Hebrews and the Solomonic line of kings or in the newer version it says um that Wallace Budge published after this is the first one so this is the first edition that Wallace Budge had published um the one we had received before was the second edition now there there are minor differences between the first and the second edition not so much in the text but in some of the information in the foreword not that much but there is some difference what we decided to do was publish the first edition let's start out by studying and researching the first edition first and the second or next editions next so this is now available the queen of sheba and her only son minulik published by the line of Jewish society and we recommend that you get your copy and it's under the Ethiopian literature biblical and african studies so get your copy today shalom rastafari